Hello family, grace to you. Once again, this is Greg coming to you from faithsmessenger.com. The title of today's message is Discovering Your God-Given Potential. Discovering Your God-Given Potential. You know, Michael Jordan was regarded by many as the greatest basketball player of all time. His game was so far superior above his peers. It was almost no competition on most nights. Picasso, the world-renowned painter, had greatness on the inside of him to the extent that he was able to take the images that he saw inside and, and through his hands, uh, convert them, transpose them onto canvas. He's one of the great painters of the world. Each one of us has greatness on the inside of us. Each one of us has world-changing greatness and potential on the inside of us, but it's up to us to tap that potential, whatever that potential may be, and allow God to use us in whatever capacity we were creating. What a tragedy it would be for someone who had the athleticism of a Michael Jordan to live a, 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 an ordinary life, to live a life that wasn't necessarily bad, but a life that didn't showcase the gifts, talents, and abilities that God placed inside of him, and to go on to be with the Father, go on and die and go to heaven, and find out what God had for him, what God placed in him that was never tapped. So I'm submitting to you that we all have greatness on the inside of us. We all have world-changing greatness on the inside of us. And I would encourage you to tap into that greatness. There are so many needs in the body of Christ. There are so many needs in the world. I'm talking about world-changing needs. An idea, a, uh, an invention, something that can change the lives of the masses forever. Um, look what the microchip did to the world. Um, I'm talking on a level like that, and those types of ideas, those types of gifts are in us as believers. And I want to encourage you today to seek God as to how He can use you as to what he placed in you and tap the potential. He gave you that potential to be used and to be exposed here in this time, in this life, on this earth. So I would encourage you to seek the greatness that's within you. Seek the potential that's within you. Yield yourself to God and allow him to change the world through you. So I want to leave you with that today. And if you have not subscribed to our YouTube channel, I'd like to invite you to do so by clicking on the red subscribe button on your screen. By doing so, you will receive notifications when new videos such as this one are posted. And I'd like to speak to any fellow Christian YouTubers out there. I'd like to invite you to join us in our community at micro-ministries.com. Now this community was created solely to help you drive traffic to your Christian channel. God has given you a word, and that word needs to be seen and shared by the masses. So what we do is we offer support, encouragement, we offer training, anything that we can possibly do to help, tra help get traffic to your Christian YouTube channel. So once again, that address is micro-ministries.com. Now that is a private community, so you'll need an invitation. What you'll need to do is send me an email message at faithsmessenger at gmail.com, and I'll get that invitation right over to you. And last but not least, I would like to invite those of you who haven't joined us on our blog yet to do so by going to faithsmessenger.com. We currently have over 550 individual blog posts on the blog which address a myriad of different topics, real life, everyday topics that each one of us has to deal with. So once again, that address is faithsmessenger.com. So now with all that's been said today, I would like to leave you with a question. Now this question can be applied to anything you may be battling in life. And that question is, is anything impossible with God? Have a great day, family. I love you, and I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.